Hello, welcome to Linux Help Tutorial. In this segment, we are going to see how to install WordPress with the Nginx Web Server and MariaDB database. The initial step is installing LEMP. So first we can install Nginx and MariaDB and after the uh, installation and configuration we can install WordPress tool. So at first download the RPM package of Nginx from its official site. So the, this is the link to uh, download the RPM package of Nginx. Nginx RPM package is downloaded successfully. So once the RPM package is downloaded, run this command to install Nginx package. And now give M install Nginx. And here we have installed Nginx. And uh, before configuring Nginx, we can install MariaDB and also PHP. So M install mariadb-server and php-apm and also php-mysql and once all the necessary packages are installed uh, we can continue with configuration so I just start with nginx and open the nginx configuration file etc nginx and inside that conf dot directory there you can see default dot conf file so in this file place these two lines outside of location category and inside this location category add this line And since we are using PHP, uh, just add one more content in index category. So index dot PHP, and at last enable the fast CG lines. And here, just replace the line. So I'm changing this to dollar request and underscore file name. Once the simple config is made, just save and quit the file. So by default in PHP, uh, both the username and group name will be assigned as Apache. So we need to change that to Nginx. So the file location is etc php fpmd and inside that we can see www.conf. So there search for Apache and here you can see user equal to Apache. So I am changing this to Nginx and also in next line change the group name also to nginx and save and quit the file and this basic setup is more enough for installing wordpress so at first i'm going to start all the service and then we can proceed with wordpress installation service nginx start and service php hyphen fpm start and the db that is maria db start so in syntway 7 we have to enable the services so system ctl enable all the three services Maria DB. So all the three services are now enabled and now we can start installing WordPress and uh, WordPress package should be downloaded and installed in root location of Nginx so before that we can delete the contents located in root location of Nginx so user share 
and inside that nginx there you can see html folder so inside that html folder you may see these two files so remove those files once the contents in this directory is removed download the wordpress from its official website here we have downloaded the zip file of wordpress so first unzip this folder so once it's done uh, go to that wordpress directory and just move all the contents to outside of wordpress directory and come back and there we need to remove the zip file and wordpress directory uh, i have removed those two contents because i am going to mention this path in configuration file so it will read the dot corner file only in this category so if we keep those two files here itself it leads to error so once it's done and now check this path for the configuration file vim etc nginx conf dot and inside that default dot corner file so here here we have mentioned the path in root user share nginx html so the path is right so save and quit the file now restart the nginx service now the service is restarted and also restart the php fm service and mariadb so service php hyphen fpm restart and service mariadb restart That's all for the WordPress configuration. Now we can start installation from browser. So, so here my IP is 192.168.11.184. So call the IP in browser. And there you can get the WordPress installation page. So just click, let's go and here you need to mention the database name and oh i just forgot to create the database so we need to create the database so here you can see the list of databases and now i'm going to create a new database and the name called the next help i have created the database called linux help and create the user for uh, accessing the database so i'm going to create the user called linux and set the password and the password as one two three four five so i have created this user and grant the full privileges to that user privileges on and the db name linux help dot slash and two here mention the username and identified by the password for that user 2345 so it's grant all privileges so once it's done just to give flush privileges and exit so now mention the db details in this page so the database name i have given is linux help and the username as linux and the password as 12345 so 
so once it's done so when you click submit you get a small error that uh, it can't create wp-config.php file so just go to the command line and there you can see that wp-config-sample.php file so just make a copy of this file as wp-config.php so now open the wp-config.php file and inside that file just replace the contents what we have created that is the db name so db name here is linux help and the username username as linux and the password 12345 so now save and quit the file now just continue with run the install we will get the welcome page of wordpress so here set the site title i set the title as linux help new and username as xyz and here the password should be strong for my convenience i am just changing the password as linux at 321 so confirm is a weak password and email as just at gmail.com so now click install wordpress thus we have successfully installed wordpress now log in with the credentials here the username as xyz and the password as linux at 321 so hit login the dashboard of wordpress appears and once the wordpress is installed just check for the plugins And here you may see the available plugins you can activate or you can search for the uh, some other plugins and you can download it so to view the post just go to all posts and here you can view the post if you want to add a new post just click add new so thus we have set up the WordPress completely with the help of Nginx and MariaDB so thanks for watching this video